I uh, grew up doing this. I grew up in the shed rows. This is all I've ever known, and this is what I love to do. And that's the reason I do this is because I love it. Cody Joyner learned the game from his father, Michael, who has conditioned many grade one winners through the years. Cody spent most of his 20s and all of his teenage years working for his dad before going out on his own. It's just a way of life and you, you don't see too many retired horse trainers. Cody started dreaming of winning the All-American as a kid playing in his father's barn. I was running races with my brother up and down the shed rows. <laughs> That's the race that we were running for. So as long as I can remember, this is the race that everyone wants to win. Cody will saddle his first All-American horse on Labor Day. This is my first qualifier. And speaking, it just made my dream come true. The filly responsible is Native T. Rose. Cody picked her out of the Riadoso Select Yearling Sale broke her on the farm, and watched the transformation from potential racehorse into a strong contender for Quarter Horse's richest race. I think that this filly is, she's very sound. She's coming into her own right now. She's, she's gonna be a force if she'll leave the gates like she did the other day. Joyner likes to wear pink in honor of one of his heroes, Jack Brooks. But it will be a game time decision on whether he'll wear Mr. All-American's signature shirt on race day. Let me tell you, Jack is probably the He's the Tiger Woods, the Jack Nicklaus of, of quarter horse racing. He's, he's an incredible icon, and that's who I would strive to be. That's what I want to do. And I think Jack won his first one when he was probably in his 30s. And here I am, going to try to do the same thing. And yes, this is a tribute partially to Mr. Brooks. <laughs>